Wow, what an insanely moving campaign. Now, aside from being a celebration of family, friends and good spirit, the festive season is also a chance to bring out some show-stopping dishes to both impress and, of course, spoil your loved ones. We have given a traditional Christmas lunch, a little local is lack a makeover, combining favourite flavours that we all know and love. So the Taste Master finalist, Imtiaz Hart, is here to show us some of his culinary magic and uh, to make sure that we put the feast in the festive season. So to get the recipe, SMS the keyword Woolworths to double three six five zero. SMSs are charged at one round fifty each and free SMSs do not apply. Oh my word, when you were living in America, you must have eaten so much turkey. A lot of turkey. Yeah, <laughs> a it's lot like of Celine. turkey. It's yeah. Thanksgiving, you know. Oh everyone, yeah. Everybody eats turkey. Uh, <laughs> I feel like today's Thanksgiving because we are so thankful that you are here. Uh, we are. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> All right, it's just, what is your favorite thing to cook? Honestly, I love chicken. Okay, good. Yeah. So, are the foundations or the basics of making chicken the same as a turkey? It's basically all the same. We're going to do a tandoori spiced chicken. So okay. you might remember eating a lot of tandoori spiced chicken. Yeah. So this will. So this is just going to be the tandoori spiced turkey. Turkey. Okay, but the problem with turkey is that sometimes it can get quite dry because it's so big. So how are you going to make sure that this one is like? What we're going to make moist? sure is we're going to baste it every thirty minutes. Once it's in the okay. oven, we're going to take it out paste it in continuously okay. so that we make sure that we retain that juiciness, Amazing. that succulence. Lovely. Um, how good are you in the kitchen at cooking? To be completely honest, <laughs> I do this very, the bare minimum, like simple chicken breasts, broccolis, like, okay. yeah, nothing, nothing That's extravagant. That's disappointing. Nothing like that. It's very And I see that you're wearing a little, a little no. wedding ring, mm. not married? No. Okay. Well, now you know why, not maybe. Married. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it's probably the Because I don't know how to make a turkey. That's yeah, exactly. Yeah. Well, we're going to teach you today. Don't teach me. How do we get started? Okay, okay so a we're going to get started. Bowl for you. Oh, thank thanks you. For your spices. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Mo. <laughs> thank you, Mo. <laughs> Mo, what are you going to be doing with our fabulous guest? So You're going to teach him how to chop. Well, we are chopping these ingredients because we're going to stuff the cavity of the turkey. So as it cooks, the whole thing becomes flavoursome. Okay, yeah. so you guys are busy there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to start with the basting? Yes, so what I'm going to ask you to do is, you're going to cut us up some ginger. <laughs> when you say cut it, the ginger, what do I do with the skin? Do I have to peel it first? Yes, so you'll remove the skin. Oh, shucks. Okay. Okay, it's fine. Let me... No, it's fine. I'm sure I can do it. Great stuff. And while you're doing that, sorry for putting Ginny D to work. <laughs> no, 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 no. This is why I come here. It's the only time I really get anything done in the kitchen. And while honest. you're doing that, I'm just going to grate fresh pieces of garlic. So okay. it's always best to use fresh garlic. Oh, wow. I've never actually seen garlic... Um, grated before. I've, um, for somebody who doesn't cook a lot, I've actually got a garlic crusher in, at home. Garlic crushers are a good thing to use. Know, it's much so easier, helpful. it's so helpful. With technology these days, I mean. Yeah. Okay, what do I do now with these? I mean, what kind of pieces must so I cut So once you've got it off, I would just like, like small little cubes, like almost like you would cut the shallotto and onion. Okay. A nice, decent size, but not too big, depending on how much you like ginger. I like a lot of ginger. <laughs> so then let's just make it bulky. My favourite is Prince Harry. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> we do <doing> love royalty. <laughs> Apologies for that. Yeah, so how what are you doing guys now going is, over there? Yeah, it's going well. Uh, we, it's going we're well. getting I'm there. Learning something. Okay. Yeah. It's good. So we've got garlic, yeah. we've, we've got, got ginger. garlic, ginger. That's going to yeah. be the nice smell. What else? That's a nice size. Yeah. And then we're going to add done. the... See how pro this is. You are all pro. Are you teaching me or am I teaching you? Okay. <laughs> we're adding some yogurt now, so this is going to be the dressing. And then? And then just put some generous amounts of paprika. I'm going to put in a lot of turmeric because this is really good for inflammation and I feel like we can't get enough. Is that too much? I feel like that's enough. Really? Here are your vegetables. Thank you so much. Shops, so, so carrots, now add... lemon and onion. Okay. Yeah. I'm adding the paprika, and it's always as how much you like your spice element. Did we come, come up not that much? Sorry. Maybe. <laughs> I got a little bit excited, but that but looks But you can good. add more paprika if you like I'm more gonna spice. I'm going to add more paprika. I love paprika. If you love spice, yeah. let's just throw it in there. Okay. Remember to always add the spice to your level of taste. Okay, good. So in there we've got our ground cumin, turmeric, and our smoked paprika. Mm -hmm. This is this masala. This is just a little bit of masala in the Amazing. Bottom. And what was that that we used? Yogurt. The yogurt. Okay. And then tomato paste. Beautiful. 
I'll just get some Two oil. to three teaspoons. Sure, babes. What are you going to do? We are going to make a little gravy to go with our beautiful turkey. Oh, delicious. The, I think he definitely turkey. needs to learn how to make it. Definitely. Yeah. Get how me on earth do you there not you know how to cook at all? When you were living in America by yourself, what did you eat? What I did eat you survive on? Like whole foods. No, yeah, okay. whole foods. Yeah. Okay, and, so and like you eat joke. very lean, obviously. Yeah, I eat a lot of... Um, I mean, I start every day with like eggs and, and an apple and all of that. Yeah. And then I eat chicken breasts and, and okay. veggies. And Amazing. So the six pack's definitely there. It's, it's trying. It's trying okay. to be there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But my favorite cuisine is actually Indian food. Oh, really? Yeah. Really? yeah. No doubt. Hands so, down. Okay, Spicier amazing. the better, yeah. Oh, this is so good to know because yeah. I have obviously added too many spices to this no, dish. You did well. So the you spicier. are going to get. Yeah. You're going to get all the spice yeah. from me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're getting the aromas coming out sure of the bowl. Yeah, that is good. beautiful. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Cool. So you're just going that? to mix yeah. that through. Okay. Are you happy? I'm so happy. I love spices in yogurt. It's actually amazing. Is... Okay, there you go. Next step. Next okay. step. So put this one side. We'll get back yeah. to that. Mm -hmm. Let's bring in the oh, main yeah. element. Oh. Check how yeah. beautiful this turkey is. Yeah, that's one big bird. It's one big bird. So step up from chicken. So if you really want to impress your guests this Christmas, yes. I suggest buying a turkey. Okay, beautiful. Yeah. And now you're going to stuff it with those veggies. Yep. So we're stuffing it with veggies today, but honestly... I'm going to let you do that. I'll, yes. I'll, yeah, I'll go yes. in there. <laughs> Is it safe? Yeah. You go, go, in, go right in. Okay. okay. So what I generally would suggest is, because we're doing tandoori spice turkey, I'd go for a more Moroccan stuffing flavor. So Amazing. If you do it, you can get Woolworths Moroccan stuffing. Yeah. Put that in there and that will actually Lots work nice. Yeah. What about whole garlic cloves? That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Well, because just because I love garlic. Yes. And if yes, he's going to be eating it, I'm going to have to be eating it. There you go. Sure. <laughs> that can go right that in. That can go right in. <laughs> and then you're going to just tie the legs together. so that Before we do that, I just okay. want to add a little bit of this. Oh, pepper. inside. Yeah. Okay. Just so you get some nice juices. Okay. Here. And now? You I'm going to hold the legs together. Is it like that? You cross, cross them, them over. Oh. She's a lady. She's <laughs> <laughs> and love it. just tie it so that it doesn't loosen during the cooking process. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you are very cute. <laughs> Oh, All right. I try to be a gentleman. Yes. Yeah, that's good. There we go. I love gentlemen. And then okay, you done. You marinate. Okay, so now grab your brush. I feel like oh. you need to do this. Let me do this. Someone has to yeah. watch that. Then. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> let's go for this. So we're just going to start basting. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna add a nice dollop over there, and then you start brushing on that side. On this side. So just brush generously. You want to baste the entire thing. Are turkey. you a lefty? I'm not actually. I just okay. I'm trying to get around that side. Okay. Well yeah. done. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nice. Okay, and yeah. then what's cooking over here? Our gravy. So it's our onions. It's like a little onion and carrot gravy. Yeah. So we finely chop well. If you try to. So I'm going to do now. I'm just going to leave this up. <laughs> um, just a bit of that, some flour. Amazing. And stuff. Okay, so our turkey is currently being basted. I've never actually seen such a happy turkey before in my entire life. We're busy with the, with the um, what's it called again? The gravy. The gravy. And it looks like it's going to be absolutely delicious. So don't be a chicken this Christmas. Tackle the turkey and impress everyone with this local as lack of Christmas dish. Now, thanks to Woolworths, you can spend your time and energy with the family and not with the food. So to get this yeah. recipe and ingredients sent directly to your phone, simply SMS the keyword Woolworths to 33650. And of course, please remember that no SMSs one. are one round fifty each and free SMSs do not apply. This is looking great. There we go. Yes, we are basting. Love. More on the Happy? More on that side? Yeah, let's just baste mm. like I want it nice. Oh, but you're sure. going to keep on basting as it cooks, hey? Exactly. Just to keep it nice yeah. and moist. So every 30 minutes, once it's in the oven, you'll take it out every 30 minutes and continue basting it so it stays succulent and juicy. Presto! Presto. All right, so should I get the turkey into the oven? Let's do that. All right. 